New at 5.30, a Cincinnati teen is pleading guilty to shooting and killing two people. And tonight, we're learning just how much time he'll spend behind bars. That on your sides, John Genovese joins us live in the newsroom with this story. John? Well, Craig McIntosh is 19. Today, he found out he'll be at least 34 years old before he's released from prison after admitting to those killings. At 16, most teens are learning how to drive and spending time with friends. I pray for his soul. But Craig McIntosh was doing just the opposite. For him to be able to come to school and crack a slam is sad. McIntosh now pleading guilty to killing Kenneth Robinson in Lincoln Heights back in 2012. A year later in November, he says he also took the life of 22-year-old Brandon Relaford. I have to go visit my son with the, at the grave and it's not fair. It's not fair at all. During testimony, it was revealed that McIntosh killed Relaford in exchange for $5,000 and several pounds of marijuana. Relaford was expected to testify in a murder trial involving the men who arranged the deal. Hamilton County and Lincoln Heights in particular will be much safer with you in prison. Uh, for this for this time. Extra security measures were put in place for the plea deal. During trial, the brother of a witness who testified in court was shot and killed. Surprised and disgusted. These young men were allowed to come back and forth in court with cell phones. It happened the same afternoon. He took the stand. He took somebody's father, somebody's brother, somebody's son, somebody's husband, somebody's friend. Now, today's plea deal comes after his first trial ended in a mistrial. Brandon Relaford's mother tells us she's unhappy with this sentence. She says she will keep fighting for justice for her son. For now, John Genovese 9 on your side.